Hello friends, this is Priyanka. Today we are going to solve a problem on model testing on water turbines in hydroelectric power plants. In this video, we have to find out the number of turbine units required for the given data of the prototype unit. Now first, I will read what is the given question. A quantity of water available for hydroelectric station is 260 meter cube per second under a head of 1.7 meter. Assuming the speed of turbine 50 rpm and its efficiency is 82.5% determine the number of turbine units required. Assume specific speed of 890. So this was the given question. Let us first understand the given data. Now uh, if we observe quantity of water is given. So we will use here letter capital Q which is equal to 260 meter cube per second. Then head capital H 1.7 meter speed capital N 50 rpm. Then efficiency is also given. So this is the actual unit. So we will say this is the prototype. That is neta P is equal to 82.5% and which is equal to 82.5 divided by 100. And specific speed is also given that is 890. So specific speed that is we will say n to the base s that is equal to 890. And we have to find out the number of turbine units. So how to find out the number of turbine units used or we have to use for this given data that is this quantity of water, head, speed all the information is given. So for that we have to compare what is the total power and the power developed by the each turbine unit. So these two points are important. So how to calculate the total power. So for that capital P is equal to Q W H by 1000 into efficiency of this model that is efficiency of this prototype. So what is this Q that is discharge and it is in the standard unit that is 260. Now W is the water density that is 9.81 into 1000. H is the head 1.7 divided by 1000 into efficiency 82.5 by 100. So which is equal to 4336 kilowatts. So this is the total power. Now we will move for the power developed by each turbine unit. So what is the formula for this? So power developed by each turbine unit, how to calculate? So for that we have to consider the specific speed. So specific speed is 890. So ns is equal to n under root of p divided by h raised to 5 by 4. So specific speed n 890 n is that is speed is 50 under root of p. So this p is nothing but power developed by each turbine unit divided by 1.7 raised to 5 by 4. So P is equal to 1192 kilowatt. So this is the power developed by each turbine unit and this is the total power. So when we divide this 4336 divided by 1192 then we will get the number of turbine units. So number of turbines is equal to 4. 